Enzo's the son of a pizza man. Hey guys, welcome to Son of a Pizza Man. My name is Enzo, and today we're talking about making pizza. So one of my goals this year is to get more into pizza making and, and try to make it more of a, a thing where I'm, I'm experimenting and playing around and, and doing all that and getting more comfortable and um, with have, like having people over, making, making pizza for them and not feeling weird about it. So my goal is to just kind of make different recipes that I find in cookbooks, online, whatever. So I thought I would start out that process with uh, this book called Pizza Camp by Joe Badia. So Joe Badia owns uh, Badia Pizza in Philadelphia and it's been around for four or five years now. So his pizza place, uh, it's like, it's run by him and he's got like one or two other helpers and their whole thing is they make 40 pizzas a night. <clears throat> so it's a very limited kind of situation. Uh, people line up around the block to get these pizzas. He sells them by the pie, so no slices, nothing like that. Um, so it's kind of like a unique experience and his whole, his whole philosophy is, you know, making the ingredients kind of shine and, and, you know, taking your time with things and all that, all that stuff. So that's Pizzeria Badia. So Joe Badia wrote this book and uh, it's off the, off the bat, it's pretty cool looking. I love the cover, I love the typography. This like hand, handwritten, hand drawn kind of feel is, is pretty cool. Uh, this book is chock full of pictures. So if you're like me and you like visual things, there's a ton of pictures in here. So pictures of the recipes, there's a ton of pictures of Philly in here. So if you're interested in that, that's also awesome. And yeah, so, uh, so it's essentially split up into five sections. So the first section is basic pizza. Uh, the second section is white pizza. The third section is toppings. The fourth section is composed pizza, which is like specialty-ish pizzas is, is how I would, I would describe it. And then the, four, the fifth section is uh, hoagies, um, what is it, hoagies, sandwiches, etc. So he also does hoagies. So he basically suggests making the, tr the basic pizza dough into like a hoagie roll. Uh, and then you like shape it and then cut it and fill it and all that fun stuff. So, so I decided to make the basic pizza from this book and I will tell you how that went. So I tried the basic pizza recipe from Pizza Camp and overall I think it turned out well. I tried it twice because uh, the dough makes two uh, servings basically of pizza. Uh, the first time I think it was a little underdone and that was my fault. I left it in for like 10, 11 minutes. Uh, so it was underdone and then it was also a little too thick so I didn't, I didn't stretch it out enough. The second attempt was a little better. Uh, I left it in a little longer, so I left it in for like 13, 14, maybe 15 minutes. And then I also um, stretched it out some more, so that also helped. 
Um, it wasn't perfect, but it was still really good. Um, I would definitely recommend this recipe for a very basic pizza. It was super tasty. I, I think uh, adding any toppings on it, mine was just plain cheese, but if you had to toppings to it, it would make it even better. So uh, again, I highly recommend checking out um, this Pizza Camp book. Like I said, I will put the recipe in the description below so you can try it yourself and let me know how your attempt goes. Uh, I'd be curious. If you just want to comment below, that'd be awesome. If you've already tried this recipe, I want to hear about it. That'd be awesome too. Um, and uh, you can do that either here in the video, in the comment section, or if you want to hit me up on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, I will definitely be looking out for that. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And until next time, ciao for now. The only